touching ceremony has taken place at an East Midlands primary school tonight to remember a little girl who tragically died just five months after being diagnosed with a rare cancer. Rosie Perry Jones was only 11 when she died last year, but this evening a garden at the Nottinghamshire school that she loved was opened in her memory. James Robertson reports. At West Bridgeford Junior School this evening, the choir gathered in a garden to sing to assembled pupils, parents and former students. It was all to remember Rosie Perry Jones. Rosie was diagnosed in the spring of 2015 with ovarian cancer, very rare in someone aged only 11. Within five months, the aggressive disease had carried her away. And I love the way that the, the wall hugs you when you're sitting on the bench. For Rosie's mum, Diane, helping to build the garden's been therapy and comforting to know her young daughter will be remembered. She think it was the nicest thing to do for somebody to have a garden in their memory. It's just, uh, yeah, that would blow her away. But, yeah, she'd sit on the bench. She'd make a point of sitting on the bench every day. Less undulations. The garden was designed by Chelsea gold medalist Jackie Setchfield, who's also the mum of former pupils at the school. She says she was aided hugely by people touched by Rosie's story. I'm almost losing count. It's a case of everyone I've gone to for help has really understood what this garden means and bent over backwards to help. Lots of tears have actually been shed as we're talking to, to people I don't even know because they've understood how important the garden is, not only for Randy's family, but for all her chums and, and actually the community and the school. I just think it's a great gesture and it just means that Rosie will always be here, which is what she loved the most. Of, you know, she loved school, everything about it. One of those kids that went off to school with a smile on her face. So we wanted to do something as a school that Rosie's family would enjoy as well. Tonight, Jackie and Diane were in the crowd to watch Rosie's sisters, Jess and Millie, cut the ribbons to open the memorial garden. James Robeson, BBC East Midlands Today, Nottinghamshire. Oh, lovely. lovely thing to do. Just lovely. We should go back in the sun and see how it's getting along. Good idea. Because here, here everybody upstairs is going, oh, that's a good idea. <laughs> now then, the weather.